Good afternoon. Good afternoon. My name is Jill Budgie and this is my colleague Ros Smith. Hello. And your names are? My name is Kotwi. Mm -hmm. yeah. Chris. And can I have your mark sheets please? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Where are you from Kotwi? Um, I'm from Malaysia. And you? And I'm from China. First, we'd like to know something about you. Um, Chris, who do you spend time with after school? Um, I spend time with my roommates, where I cook together and doing homework together. Okay, and uh, Kokui, tell us about a good teacher you've had. Um, my good teacher, um, my econo economics teacher, his name is Darren. I like him because he gave us a lot of notes, a lot of notes every single lesson. So I find it very useful for mm. my for the education or something. Mm. Mm. And um, Chris, do you enjoy using the internet in your free time? Yes, I always <coughs> doing online shopping, or search TV shows online. Yeah, it's quite useful because I can get everything I want from. Uh, the internet. Mm -hmm. And um, Kokui, where would you like to go for your next holiday? Mm, maybe Japan, because during the winter season, because I like snow a lot, mm, I might go to there to ski or whatever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you enjoy reading? Yeah, I've started to read like Three years ago, I like fiction books a lot. I read about them every night. Mm -hmm. And recently, I just started a book called Clockwork Angels. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. In this part of the test, I'm going to give each of you two photographs. I'd like you to talk about your photographs on your own for about a minute and also to answer a question about your partner's photographs. Kokui, it's your turn first. Okay. Here are your photographs. They show people trying to win in different situations. I'd like you to compare the photographs and say what you think might be difficult for the people about trying to win in these situations. Okay. All right? Okay. Um, the first picture is a tennis tournament. It's, it's a competition between two persons and they play against each other. For the second picture, it's either marathon or running. It's, they have like a certain amount of people participated together to run. And f as for the question, what might be difficult for this for the people about about trying to win in this situation? Um, for the first picture, I think the opponent, like the level of skills of their opponents, is very important. And for the second picture, all you need is training and perseverance. And, and run until the end of the finish line. Thank you. Chris, which sport would you prefer to do? Well, I prefer tennis, but it's more fun, I think, because I can run lots in the ground and it really makes me feel relaxed. And but I can't do it in the short time because I've just twisted my ankle while playing tennis. Thank you. Now, Chris, here are your photographs. They show people spending time outside in different situations. I'd like you to compare the photographs and say what you think the people are enjoying about spending time outside in these situations. All right? Yeah. And for the first picture, they are having a picnic with their friends and their smiley face and everybody's face. 
they seem very happy to chat with each other and spend the time with friends、um, in the good weather. And for the second picture, the girls are、um, hanging out on the street. They may go shopping or looking for the restaurant. And they spend the time with best friends and、um, enjoy with the time with each other, like shopping with each other or、um, just like、um, oh, I think.、Um, Because more people there, so people might more enjoy spending this because、um, have more fun. Thank you. Thanks.、Um, and Kokui, which of these things would you prefer to do?、Um, the first one, like the picnic, because you can socialize with people and eat good, good food and enjoy the weather in the park, as compared to the second picture. Because I'm not a shopping person, and I don't like to walk a lot, so I prefer the first picture rather than the second. Thank you. Now I'd like you to talk about something together for about two minutes. I'd like you to imagine that a school is going to start some after-school classes. To encourage their students to learn new skills, here are some ideas for the classes, and a question for you to discuss. First, you have some time to look at the task. Now talk to each other about why students might want to learn to do these skills.、Um, students might want to learn another language because it's very useful for their future. They can communicate with other people using the certain language, and they can make more friends using the language and. If you learn another language, like、um, the university will like be in more interested in you because you are multilingual.、Um, that's what I thought. Yes, but what if the student can't speak English very well and learn still learn another foreign language? The two language will mix up and might and、um, not speak both of it very well. Do you think? I won't reckon that because if the student are not capable of their first language of what they are speaking, they won't take the another link to learn another language.、Yeah. Okay, as students that play sports well, it's another good thing to learn. Because being healthy is also very important compared to just studying all the time. Do you agree?、Mm, yes, I love <laughs> playing sports. And I think studying to play a musical instrument is might be popular as well. Because、um, I just if I was a boy and I play guitar, it's more useful to attract a girl. Yeah. Do you think? In at your point of view, I agree. But some people learn instruments is because of their passion. They love playing music and they love、yeah. music. Thank you. Now you have about a minute、yeah. to decide which two would be the <coughs> easiest to learn to do well. Okay, for me. In my in my opinion, cooking a meal and playing sports is very simple for me. 
do you think is simple? Yes, and I think draw well as well, because everybody can draw and the whatever we draw is like a picture. And yes. But you need to take classes in order to draw well. Well, we can do much more practice in our spare time. Okay. Uh, but if practice isn't playing sport and drawing well, both similar because both you just yes. need to practice for practice. both. Then you can do well in each of them. Yes. Yeah. But they also need talent to do this. Yeah. But, but let's not talk about mm. talent. Okay, thank you. Do you think classes like these would be popular with students, Chris? Yes, I think so. For me, I, I would like to go to this class after school because I have nothing to do without doing homework at home. So it's better uh, to have class learn some new things and make some new friends. Mm. Do you agree? Okay. Yeah, because in order to learn new things, you can use your time efficiently and not waste time and just lay it, lay it on the bed at home and do nothing looking at the ceiling. And learning a new skill is better than doing nothing. That's what I thought. How important do you think it is for people to try new activities, Kokui? Um, that's a phrase that says that um, no pain, no gain. That's what I think because if you don't try new stuff, you won't know are you capable of doing that certain um, thing and just try it and you will know and are you supposed to do it and that's what I think. Mm. Yeah. Do you agree? Yes, I think so because we're all, um, most of people love studying new things because uh, there are a lot of new things we have to learn in this world. And it's, it's much fun than just doing the same thing over and over again. Hmm. Um, why do you think some people don't like to try new things? Mm. In my opinion, people don't like to try new things because they know that they are not capable of doing that thing or either they like their current, what they are doing right now. Yes. How about you? Uh, yeah, I think so. And they might worry about someone might laugh at them because they can't do it well. Yeah. So that's, so they don't yeah. want to do yeah. new things. Maybe society will like judge mm -hmm. them because yes. of their weakness or mm -hmm. something they are lacking. So. Thank you. A lot of people enjoy doing sport after school. Do you think this is a good thing, Chris? Yes, because we're doing work um, in the day and it's time for us to do some uh, sports after school and have some fun with friends and um, stretch our muscles like this, have a rest. Do you agree? Cool. Yes, I do agree. Because I think that humor must be mentally and physically active, just rather than just studying or they memorizing terms. They must like do sports to trigger and activate some of their body cells mm -hmm. in, to be healthy. Thank you. What do students enjoy doing after school in, in China? Um, some of them may enjoy playing computer games, but most of us don't have choice to do this because we've got tons of homework mm. to do. We might spend whole nights doing homework. And how about in Malaysia? Mm, in Malaysia, most students study as what she said, but we have extra co-curricular activities in school. so. Students can choose what to do mm. between two choices, but most of them just go home and study all night. Thank you. That's the end of the test. Thank, Thank you. you.